Greetings, worthy wizard. It has come to my attention that Ravenwood has finally taken the lead in the arcane art of dueling. Although Pigsvig Academy was once renowned throughout Wisteria for being masters of the sport, of late we have not prospered. I have requested a tutor from Wizard City, and they sent you. So be it. Shall we get started? Your first pupils are Rusty Tinderspark, an Ember Wizard, and Cora Winterbranch, a student of Frost. Proceed to the Chamber of the Hydra and face them in a duel. Don't be too hard on them, but don't be too gentle either. Hi there, I'm Rusty Tenderspark. I study Ember Magic. It's not very exciting, but it is very comforting. Wow, that was very invigorating. You sure put me through my paces. Thanks, wizard. Ouch. Oh, I have a much better idea how all this magic stuff really works now. I wonder if I can transfer to Ravenwood. You taught Rusty and Cora a thing or three, yes? Good. I expected nothing less, and would have been shocked if you had failed. Ember students are a docile lot, while Frost students tend to freeze up. Still, this was a good experience for them. Proceed to the Hall of the Spectre. Piper Stormtree, a young Tempest scholar, and Gramble Goldrook, a Chaos Wizard, await you. You're the wizard who... I'll show you the hidden... I have been taught that sweet or bitter, all experience is enriching and rewarding. I hope we can teach you a thing or two. What a charge! I'm sure I'll do better in my next duel. Your teaching was very uh, instructive. I'm going to go lay down for a bit. Piper and Gramble will remember your lessons for a long time. At least until those bruises heal. But your work here cannot be all fun and games. There's serious dueling to be done. Your next opponents are at the top of their classes. Elia Dunerunner is an adept of Earth Magic. While Gemma Blackheather is well-versed in spirit magic. A deadly duo. They are also both exchange students, so try not to rough them up too badly. They await you in the Hall of the Harpy. Taste the dirt. Nalia didn't prepare me for how tough you Wizard City folks can be. A series of critical workshops from you. I confess I did not really expect a tenth so much from a pupil of Diego's. The students have been speaking so highly of you that our own headmistress, Belladonna Crisp, has come down to observe. These last students are a trio of brothers who specialize in equilibrium but who cannot seem to push past their boundaries. Yes, what are we waiting for? I don't think we need to waste time on formal greetings, do we? Head into the chamber of the Basilisk and show me how well you are taking care of our students. Put them through their paces and ensure someone learns something today.
I was sure I could stand up against that wind. What will Mother think? Huff and puff. I apologize, wizard. You know far more than I would have guessed. Please go tell Master Glen Deming and Headmistress Crisp that your teachings have been invaluable. With luck, Pigswick will give Ravenwood a real run for its money at the next tournament. Wizard, you must help us! Up here, show these brutes a thing or two and get us out of these infernal cages. Don't dilly-dally. Who are you? Did we leave the portal open behind us? Curses. Well, no matter. Edacious ogres, add them to the staff. If you let me down in this, you'll be cleaning the backboards for a week. Blech. I hate trying to get the taste of a racer out of my mouth. I'm going to bury you in homework. Last time the ogres were in Wisteria, they brought back all of these colorful pamphlets. I've read a lot of good things about Pigwick Academy in these brochures. How fancy the program is, how expansive, how liberal-minded the coursework is, how restful the exam period. Pigwick sounds like a wonderful place. So wonderful that I wanted to start my own franchise. What better way than to seed my faculty with their plum staff? I already headhunted a headmistress and a master of arms for my new school. Let's find out what position you should fill. <laughs>
What do you mean I got an F? I thought this wasn't about great. Ah, thank you. Once again, Ravenwood proves its merit. When that beast appeared in Vestiria, we were powerless against him. We are clearly victims of our own marketing department's success. I'll have to speak to someone about those brochures. Regardless, wizard, you saved our skins. I won't forget this. We really have a lot to teach each other, don't we? <laughs>